Good morning, classy, classy people. How y'all doing? It is Sunday morning. Your Speed King is in the studio on Sunday. I'm here to do a Cinnaboya Downs on Monday. That's right, it's Derby Day. Manitoba Derby up in beautiful Canada. This is for my Canada Connections. Trevor and the rest of the guys and gals up there. We have quite a few uh, people from Canada that that subscribe to the channel, that are members, like Trevor, he, he's the ambassador, our Canadian ambassador up there, Trevor, he's a good dude. And we're going to be doing a Cinnaboya, a very small track up there in Canada, uh, a Cinnaboya Downs, I believe I'm saying that right, Trevor, correct me. But they run Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, and I actually play that track uh, those three days, you know, very, very cheap claimer, it's a lot of fun. I'll be sitting in the in the um, uh, studio working on next week's stakes and I'll shoot some dollars around. But it's Derby Day up there on Monday. Uh, they got a $1 million guaranteed payout, mandatory, pick five. Okay? And it's races four through eight, I believe. And uh, we're going to put it together a ticket. We already put together a ticket. But I wanted to run through the Derby. And the Derby is the seventh race on the card. It's for three-year-olds, straight three-year-olds, going a mile. Uh, I think it's a mile and the eighth here. Um, yes, yeah, going one mile and the eighth for $100,000. So I wanted to do, give our Canada Connections their Derby. You see me with my Derby shirt on. And I, have, I like this track. I mean, I, I don't think I've ever seen claimers cheaper than this at the track. But I have a bunch of fun there. So let's dial right in. It is a, a field of 12. Now, I want to take a lot of a time doing this because it looks pretty lopsided, if you ask me. The number one horse, Cozy Bear. Cozy Bear speed figure is very, very light in here. This horse is a former claimer, um, you know, and I guess they're trying to catch lightning in a bottle with the number one horse, Cozy Bear. Now, I would say that, you know, he is, uh, has no speed. He's a Deep, deep closer the number one horse, and I think if you're going to use them, use them underneath. The number two horse, right? Stone Cafe. Twelve starts, two wins, two seconds, and one third. Well, Stone Cafe again is another former claimer, uh, twenty thousand, fifteen thousand going into this year's stake race, and the number two horse, Stone Cafe, looks uh, overmatched. Well, here's your favorite, and I believe is the winner of the race, the number three horse, and I believe he is the single one, our pick five ticket. Uh, my Optic, my Optic, the number three horse, came uh, here by way of Indiana last start, previously racing at Santa Anita, trained by Bob Baffert at Santa Anita, then he was turned over to Mr. Bressett for the Indiana race on June 23rd, and the Dorio has him now. So, this horse's speed figure, my optic, the number three horse, who's eight to five on the morning line, is dropping in to a uh, Cinnaboya on Derby Day into this Derby race, and speed figure really towers over this bunch. The horse is very, very speedy. Uh, don't think he's going to beat the eight horse to the front, uh, Euro's uh, Silver Biz. But he will be sitting right behind your old Cyril Biz, and will get the first jump on this field. And the number three horse, my optic, uh, you know, a national trainer is dropping in, uh, the Dorio, and uh, he should win the race. I mean, the horse is by Candy Ride, got three starts, just one win. Uh, he's coming off of a maiden special uh, win at Indiana 40 days ago, so the horse should be fresh. And he only had three starts, but this Kentucky bred by Candy Ride uh, on a back end by Spoken Woman out of America, Spoken one Woman who's out of Unbridled. The number three horse should win the Derby, up the, uh, the Manitoba Derby up there uh, on Derby Day. Uh, the number four horse, uh, well, Wits, Wits is another horse with ten starts, two, two wins and one, one second. Uh, has a very, very nice line, uh, but speed figures are just too late, uh, too too light. So the number four should be thrown out in this spot at 15 to 1 here on the line in the Derby. And uncharacteristic, well, the number five horse, uncharacteristic, four starts, one wins. A lot of these horses only have one win. 
right? They're very light three-year-olds. This horse is gelded. Speed figures is real, real light on uncharacteristic. Um, I don't like this horse at all in this spot. Well, a two-bay bayou. Well, a two-bay, uh, the number six horse, uh, you know, this horse is 30 to one. And I kept looking at this number six horse. I think I'm saying the name right. A two-bay uh, bayou. And he's 30 to 1. And I would suggest that this would be our long shot in the race in terms of exactors and trifactors and superfactors. The number six horse speed figures are climbing. Uh, this horse is by way of Keeneland and Churchill and Tampa Bay, uh, no, Turfway Park, not Tampa Bay. And he's a deep, deep closer, the number six. I think he could pick up a piece of the, the, the pie here. So I'm going to make him our second choice behind my optic, the number three horse. So it's going to be three six for us. The six horse is 30 to one. I want to shake it up a little bit, you know, so the, the number six at 30 to one, we're going to make him our second choice. The number seven horse, well, Major Shepherd. Major Shepherd uh, has seven starts, one win. Um, again, a former claimer coming off a claiming maiden race. Won in maiden special last time for 16,000 by, by a neck. Speed figures is probably the worst in the field. Let's throw the number seven off the ticket. And the number eight horse, Euro Silver Biz. Euro Silver Biz is the speed of the race. I think he's going to get in front of my optic going around the first turn, which is going to really set my optic up because my optic has enough speed where he should be sitting uh, second to number three. So the number eight horse at 30 to one. Uh, is going to fade probably into the back stretch around the far coming home, and we're going to throw the eight off the ticket. And the number nine horse, uh, Hero uh, Warriors Hero, 14 starts and two wins. One of the few horses in the race, the number nine, with multiple wins in the race for 35,000. The horse is coming out of a stake race, uh, did run third to Flash of Glory here, and uh, which is the 10 horse and the Wits horse, which is the number four horse. And, you know, I'm not so negative on the number nine horse, you know. So I think he's going to be our third choice in the race. We're going to go three, six, nine. My optic, obviously, in, into Bayou, the number six at 30 to one. I believe the number six, obviously, is going to be a big, big trifecta threat. And the number nine horse will be our third pick. And the number 10 horse, we just spoke briefly about him. He did beat the number 9 in the last start on July 12th. Uh, the speed figures are a little light. I think he's going to react a little bit. He is returning in 21 days. He's got 14 starts and 3 wins. Another horse with multiple wins in the race. He's only 8 to 1, so I would use the number 10 horse underneath. And the last two horses in the race, the number 11 horse, well... Uh, Mr. Snickers, Mr. Snickers, five, five starts, one win. Speed figures are just too light here. Let's throw the Mr. Snickers, the number 11, off the ticket. And the number 12 horse, the last horse, the Midnight Salute horse. Midnight, not trained by Asmussen. Every time we hear Midnight, we think it's an Asmussen. Well, the number 12, Midnight Salute, got four starts with one win. Again, speed figures like the number 11, Mr. Snickers, are very, very light in this race, and I don't think he has much of a chance. So, there's your Monitou Derby at uh, Semboya uh, on Monday. It is their derby race. I wanted to do a thing on them, but I really want to play this pick five for a million dollars. That's a guaranteed uh, uh, payout, and I will be doing a video directly after this one. But I wanted to do a standalone derby, the seventh race tomorrow, Monday, August 2nd, um, going a mile in the eighth. And we believe that the number three horse, My Optic, is eight to five. The Dorio uh, is dropping in town um, to win uh, to win this here hundred thousand dollar derby, and uh, I think he will do it. He will be my single, the number three in the derby, in the pick five. Okay, so our top picks here in the Derby in the Manitou Derby on Derby Day up there, beautiful at uh, at Sinboya, I believe I got that right. Trevor is the number three horse. My optic, we believe he's uh, heads over hills, speed figure towers over these, and the number nine horse uh, will be our third pick. And our big bomb in the race is the E2 Bayou.
Okay, the number six at 30 to one. Hey, play that horse in the trifecta. You know there's 20 cent plays up there, so you can do some mighty things if you use the six horse at, at 30 to one underneath and play with some tries and stuff. You can have some fun up there. It is 20 cent bets. So there you go, my Canadian connection, Trevor and company over there, our Canadian ambassador here on the channel. We did the Derby Day up in beautiful Canada at Sin Boya, and we love the number three horse, My Optic. Dropping in, he's going to be the single on our uh, pick five ticket as well. So as always, folks, stay classy in all you do. It's my first Canada uh, Manitoba Derby that I've ever done. Didn't even know the track exists, but I do have a bunch of fun up there. They got 20 cents all over the place. And I mean, really, you can't get hurt. Uh, you know, during the week when you play this track, and I'll be here doing work for the weekend, so we do it. So as always, folks, here's our disclaimer. The information that we use on this video is for entertainment purposes. Our disclaimer is down in the description. As always, subscribe to our channel, ring the bell, join our membership, and if you want a Speed King shirt, as always, email us, speedking 24 at yahoo.com, speedking 24 Stay classy in all that you do. My friends up in Canada, Derby Day Monday. Enjoy yourself. Have a bunch of fun, and I'll talk to you real soon. Hey, stay tuned for my pick five ticket. It's a million-dollar carryover or a million-dollar payout. It's got to get paid. You know I'm going in there. Once again, Canada, there you go. My friends up there, the nicest people on planet Earth. Enjoy yourself. Stay classy. When the folks go low, you know what to do. We're classy. We stay high. Enjoy your Sunday as we move towards another work week. Enjoy the Derby tomorrow.